some of you at home thinking like you could eat McDonald's, huh? Yeah, yeah, you gotta yeah, come and check this out. Yeah. Welcome back to yummyjubbly.com. This is Rob. Today we're gonna to be having some amazing Chinese food at China Palace, right next to Excel Exhibition Center with a YouTube super guest. So let's go find out who it is. All right, so this is the YouTube sensation that I'm talking about. So if you guys have been living under the rock and you don't know who this guy is, this guy is Master Wong Wing Chung System. If you like to eat Chinese food like me, then you need to come and check some stuff we're gonna test out later. Some nice quality food. So we're at China Palace at the moment and we've been invited here really kindly by the, the, the restaurant owner to try out some of their amazing Chinese food. I'm so excited. We've just done a workout with Master Wong. He almost killed me, so I'm really hungry now. So. I'm prepare him to eat. That's why I can make him nice, appetized, and ready to taste some nice food. So it's gonna be fun, yeah? It's gonna be awesome. All right, so our starters are here. Master, are you excited? You better Don't be. Because I'm gonna love it. This kind of, you know. We just did some mountain climber exercise, and the food here looks like a pile of mountain of food. I think this is a lot more like traditional Chinese, yeah? Mm. Traditional Chinese and this one as well. Lobster, very traditional Chinese. So if you came in this place, China Palace, and this is the dish, you need to check it out. Okay, my let's check. Can we eat now? Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> let's do it. I think I'm going to have the lobster first. Let's, let's, let's try one. These scallops, not lobster. I'm too excited. Look at these scallops. Look at how big they are. It looks like there's some crushed peanuts. I'm going to show you this garlic or peanuts. And it also has like a soy sauce as well and a piece of chili on top. Master Wong, do you think I can get one bite? I reckon you, your mouth's that big. I think it should be one bite. It should be full right in, I reckon. Right. I'm not that greedy. I don't have. One moment. Yeah. So it's definitely peanut. I just love the crunch and the creaminess from that peanut. Actually very fresh in it. That is so bouncy. It's cooked perfectly, it's not rubbery at all. And the, 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 the sauce. sauce on top is not overly salty, it just complements the, uh, the scallop. Perfect. Well, That's the problem with it. Always remember to cut them lobster instead of eating one thing at a time. Perfect. There's actually a slight sweetness as well. Mm, I'm, not, I'm not sure where this is um, from. More freshness, so that's why it's uh, very sweet. Very nice. Must mm. who's sweeter, me or the, or the sky? You need to ask your wife. <laughs> I prefer scallop. I put him in the grill. I put, put him in the grill and see how sweet he is. Mm. Alright, now we're on to the quail. And uh, I'm just kind of speechless because it just looks so wonderfully charred. The most important thing with this kind of quail is got to be nice and juicy. This is cooked to perfection. Oh, you see what I mean? That. You see the shine inside? Yeah, yeah. You know that's juicy, just looking at that shine. Yeah? You like it? I can see why you're sighing like that now, you know what I mean? You love the food too much, yeah? I love it, Master Wong. I can't blame you. There's no this polite way of eating it. It's definitely a hand thing. So this is like um, the dressing it comes with. That definitely gives it that nice saltiness and that citrus from that like lime juice really does elevate. I just cut through the fat from the quail. So that, and that chili gives that slight kick as well. Like Master Wong's kick. I tell you, this thing here definitely uh, complement the dish very well. Mm. Yeah. If you if you eat it normally with that alone, that'd be fine. But when you add this on as well, it's completely different thing. Very nice. It's that and it's really that char on the surface, Master Wong. Mm. That gives it that nice smoky flavor. You know when we eat it, you know you're gonna love it to taste it because it's just so nice, you know. All right, now we're gonna have the deep fried lobster with salted egg yolk. Master Wong, I'll let you go first. I think I'm gonna show something like this one here. Oh, good choice. Wow. Just for that yeah. freshness. Wow. That's salt and pepper is nice, huh? 
and the meat inside is still like really juicy. I think the salt and pepper they blend very well. Mm. So you don't taste salty. I think I'm just gonna dig it. Oh, look at that. Look how juicy it is. Mm. All right, this deserves a one bite, I think. Uh -huh. The juice, it exploded in my mouth. The crow is the most juicy part. You can taste the sweetness come out of it. Okay. Mm. This is the papaya salad with the uh, grilled pork liver. Master one's already, already eating. And it's like really thinly sliced uh, papaya, a grilled uh, liver, and also there's some mint as well, which will give that nice freshness. I like the mint. Uh, uh, sometimes people don't like liver, you know. Mm. But liver mixed with this and mixed with some peanut is perfect combination. I think if you want to get this dish, even if you don't get the liver and you just have a salad and the nuts and mint alone, That'd be it'd, good. Be, it'd be amazing. Very nice. It looks like Master Wong approved. Mm. I like it. And now that you see I'm standing up, but for this particular meal, you need to stand up. I'm gonna let Master Wong have a seat here because he's been eating a lot and I think he needs to digest. <laughs> but this is the lamb hot pot. I get to see it bubbling away at the moment. Look at this. Just smelling it, it's making my mouth water. So this is a basically a cross between like a, like a, a lamb a pot with a hot pot. So you can actually cook all your raw ingredients in this hot pot. So let's just put some of these raw ingredients in here. And uh, I think it will almost done because it's coming back up to a boil now. So let me try some out. Yeah. He's talking too much, you know. I just want to some, get some action. There's different layers of the meat. There's like some fat, some of the uh, the leaner part as well. And there's also some like um, some bones at the end. So you know that it's going to be packed with flavor. If you add the shrimp paste to it, you've got different texture, different taste. Yeah, it's very different. Mm. I love it. You haven't tried hot pot before. This is not a normal hot pot, you know. It's a Vietnamese style hot pot. It doesn't really matter what style it is. It's just good. We're just gonna soak up all of the the broth. But it's really hot, so careful. Don't jump into it like me. You you find everything you put all in here. All the flavor coming together. You see. You see all the flavor come together. Mm. There's a lot of different herbs and spices that's gone into the broth and it's been bubbling for a long time in the kitchen and you bring it out here on top of a stove it's quite theatrical you know you have your stove you have the hot pot bubbling and then you kind of cook your own food you got to put some shrimp paste on top as well and it's just a very nice entertaining way to have your dinner so Mars Wong do you approve? Perfect! Alright so we came to the end of the meal and we are fully satisfied, well my belly is fully satisfied but it really comes down to what Master Wong thinks What do you think Master Wong? I think it's uh, if you like Chinese food you have to come and this place, check it out not because we, I say so it's really, you need to taste it and really find out for yourself, it, right or not but I say, this is one of the best Chinese restaurants I've ever come across and if you don't believe me, you come in here and you try them out and you know what I'm talking about straight away. Uh, if you come in and then you say Master Wong sent you here, you get 10%. That's right, yeah. right. Just mention Master Wong sent you here. They will look after you and they give you a 10% discount. And that's what I can do to helping you to give you the chance to taste of Chinese food and Chinese culture. All right, so I'm going to put a link down below exactly where you can find this place. I hope you like this video. I hope you like my song. If you did, give us a thumbs up. Remember to subscribe for more videos in the future. That's right. Make sure to subscribe because your enemy do. Otherwise, your enemy is going to eat more Chinese food and look better looking than you. Then you have problems. So subscribe to us and then you will see more of this video of the, the fat boy and me. Bye.